today we're going to do a Disney inspired video. Now I don't know how Halloween this is, it's probably not really, but I just thought it was super cute and I've just been dying to do it so I decided what the heck. This is a super cheap project but I promise you it is worth it. Today we're gonna make this cute, grab it, uh, Snow White Poison Apple Mug and this costs me in total three dollars maybe to make and look how cute now if you're not familiar with the poison apple from Snow White like my husband wasn't and he looked at this and said um what is that here is kind of an image of what it looks like for you know for some reference I did use a a multi-surface paint that can be used on ceramic and it is dishwasher safe once it is cured. Thank you for stopping by my channel. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. If you're new here, hi, I'm Ashley. I do craft projects and occasionally I do cakes and I kinda just ramble and do whatever I randomly feel like doing. So go ahead and subscribe if you're new here and join in on the fun. Hit the notification bell uh, so you know every time I post a new video and go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you like Snow White. And if you haven't seen Snow White, what are you doing? Go watch Snow White. Watch this video first and then go watch Snow White. Let's just get into making this cute Snow White mug because I, not gonna lie, I think it turned out pretty good and I'm pretty excited to show you guys how simple this mug was to make. So let's go make a Snow White Poison Apple mug. Lego! I started with just a plain white mug, preferably something kind of apple shaped if you can find it. This was kind of the best I could find and I got this at Walmart for about two dollars. We're also going to need some multi-surface paint in apple red. Make sure you read your instructions on your paint that tells you how to cure it so that way you can use it and wash it without your paint running off. Um, mine says to air dry for 21 days or to air dry for one hour and then bake it. So just make sure you read your instructions in order to get it cured correctly. So a little tip of what I do so I don't waste a dish or anything. I actually usually just squirt the paint into the lid of the paint because it's already going to get paint on it anyways. And now I'm also going to use this image of the Snow White Poison Apple mug that I just googled so I know kind of where to put the eyes and the mouth and the bottom apple part, which is pretty much just everything I'm going to paint in red. So I'm going to eyeball where to paint in red using my image for reference, and I'm just going to start painting on some of my multi-surface paint onto this mug. This is probably the hardest part of this project because you kind of have to eyeball it and just try to get it the best you can. There's no stencil and there's no perfect way to do it. So I did end up like, you know, adjusting sizes. I realized at first I made the eyes and the nose too small, so I went back and made them larger. And you're just going to cover all of the parts on the apple that look red in the image with the red paint. Once you have that done, you're going to set it aside to air dry and you can choose your options of how you're going to cure it. According to my paint, I can air dry for 21 days or I can air dry for one hour and then bake it, which is actually the process I chose to do. So just set that aside, let it air dry or follow your instructions that are on your package and you're done. You have your mug. It's completed. It's awesome. So now you can sit back with a nice warm cup of hot cocoa and watch some Disney movies. I hope you guys liked how I made this cute Snow White mug. Comment down below and let me know what your favorite Disney movie is. I really like Snow White, um, but like as far as I, I just love so many Disney movies, there's just too many. Oh my gosh, there's just too many. I love them all. So guys, uh, comment down below. Let me know what your favorite Disney movie is. I want to know because if I've not seen it yet, I'm going to go watch it. So comment down below. Let me know what your favorite movie is because I need a Disney movie marathon in my future. Hit the thumbs up button if you liked this mug and if you like Disney because who doesn't love Disney? Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already so you can see my face every week. I'm posting twice a week through the month of October and they're all Halloween related videos. Well, sort of. I hope you guys like this video and I will see you in a couple days. Bye guys. Bye.